Hello, and welcome to Project Cat, a game that I totally have not played before, and I screwed up the recording so you could only see a fourth of the screen. This is completely my first time playing this game, I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm gonna boost up this volume a tiny little bit more so you can hear me better. Oh uh, yeah, hey gang! This is a demo for a really cute RPG horror game, and I completely screwed up recording it, looked at the footage, and was like, god damn it. Um, but I still really want to play it with y'all because it's super cute and I think that you're gonna like it just as much as I do. So, we'll do a new game and I will start from scratch. And I'm recording in the dark to freak myself out more. It's like Wednesday Adam sleeping in a forest. I seriously, I still cannot get over the art, it's just so cute. You use arrow key to move. See, I know the controls. I'm I'm a step ahead of the game. Hmm. <laughs> I really tried to walk through the gate. Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> There's a white flower on the ground. Press X to open menu and see items. That's fun. Eight. And then you see this cute little house. To use an item, stand close and select the item from the menu. A door with four colored lights. It's locked. They got all these cute vases with white flowers in them. So obviously, like, put the white flower in the vase. The flower sank into the water. Yay! <laughs> and then it cuts to this! <laughs> like, it reminds me so much of spider lilies. <laughs> Pity. You thought that would work? You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The solution may seem obvious, but... There is always another way. You may not notice it right away, but your actions will have an impact sooner or later. Also, can we just talk about the eyes popping up out of the blood water? Like... Yeah. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always in the shadow of choice. Also, you know very well this isn't your home. So why do you mess with things that do not belong to you? You are not welcome here. This isn't some silly game. Look, this is the result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. What do you think? Does this still look like a flower to you? You are not prepared to deal with the truth. Are you? I can't stop you from coming. But if you're foolish enough to cross my path... I'll kill you myself. Such is the way of our world. I just, I love, I love the atmosphere, it's so good. Whoa, weird dream. Is everybody gone already? Looks like it's 11. I should get to it. This is just like the cutest waiting screen. I'll stop calling everything cute, I promise. Also, she really just took a nap in the school until 11 p.m. But honestly, like, same. Oh no! You moved it! I didn't, I swear! You know I hate this type of thing! This can't possibly be happening. It's spelled DIE! Oh my, oh no. Stop joking around, this is serious. Uh, I should not have played with this. I told you we're going to be cursed! Yikes. 
What was that? Is that a ghost? We summoned a ghost. Oh my, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It just can't. You're making too much noise. <laughs> it just can't. God, I love her. What's with the crazy knocking? What was that for? Did that spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. I could say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually, say hello to the new member of the Occult Club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all of the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three aren't part of the club, are you? That's funny. I didn't pin you of all people as the occult type cat. That's because I'm not. Hey, but you're doing something here. I'll save you the trouble. All three of you moved it. Huh. The planchette from your game, you all moved it. There's no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the IGV. Ideal motor effect. <laughs> Simply put, just like your body reacts to pain reflexively, it may also rip into the giant <laughs> In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are really just your imagination playing tricks on you. If you are interested in the ideal motor effect, I'ma put the Wikipedia page up on the screen. There you go. Great job killing the mood. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, Cat. Always a pleasure. Alright, time to search. I should go over my notes to make sure I don't forget anything. I have the notes with me. Ritual notes. I have a lighter and I have 12 candles. I need three rooms, 12 candles, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, and a troll. I need to sort the desks in each classroom, turn off all the lights and draw the curtains in each classroom, draw a path going through three rooms with chalk in the middle. In the middle room, place one candle on each desk, light the candles and wait five minutes, and then burn the hair, blow out the candles, count to 100, open your eyes, and then... You summoned a demon! Alright, so I need to search the school for items first. The room should be in this room. Somewhere. I wonder where. Can I like join you? Don't even bother sitting with us after you ruined our night. Ouija game. <laughs> Ouija. That's not that funny, but I think it's cute. Anywho. Suspicious news articles and posters representing magic circles. Small plants. I love plants. the school window open that big like dang a crystal ball <laughs> she's such a pessimist like dang cardboard boxes mark the symbol they're sealed with tape the runes my friend mentioned may be in here but I need a way to open it a shit ton of globes. There's so many globes. Trash can. It seems to be full. There's some chalk here. Take chalk? Sure. How did that get there? Well, there's no one here to stop me from running. All right, let's see. According to my notes, I need to move the desks to the sides in all three classrooms. Then I can draw a path in the middle of each one with chalk. Well, I'm sorry, I just cracked my finger. <laughs> well, I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to gather everything I need first. 
Should I sort the desks now? Sure. If I don't focus really hard, I'm gonna screw up and I'm gonna have to reset the room and then I'm gonna be really annoyed at myself. That was easy. Bro, like seriously, like... Textbooks, some random tings. I'm taking the scissors. I'm gonna open the box. Some books and chalk. Last time I only took two chalk, but this time I'm gonna take all of the chalk. <laughs> no one can stop me. <laughs> A simple trash can. Its contents look trashy. I'ma sort the desks. No use waiting around. I don't have good commentary for shoving desks other than like I'm shoving them. With my head. Shit. And only my head. Such is life. I don't think there's anything cool in here. Other than I need a curtain. So we finna have to find a curtain. Is there a light switch in this room? I was really hoping there'd be a light switch. Um, just gonna politely... I don't want broken chalk. I'm better than broken chalk. Normal chalk, though. Sure. A trash can. You feel uninclined to dig through it. Mm. No one can stop me from running in the halls. On the bright side, you don't have to watch me struggle for like an extra 10 minutes trying to push the desks. So like, Who's the real winner here, you know? Ta-da! I am a genius. This is why I was valedictorian. I am no longer valedictorian. <laughs> God, I need to stop reminding myself of my fall from grace. Okay, I do believe we have acquired all of the chalk that we can. I can't believe she would steal an encyclopedia. Also, sis, we got wiki. Like, why are you trying to take a book? Oh, I'm so silly. Finally, let's cut this open. There's a bunch of useless trash in here. Aha! This little box may be it. There's three rooms, but the ritual didn't mention a specific one. Which one should I take? Okay, look. I'm going with the weird bee because it reminds me of the bee from Bee the Beginning. Because it's like the same shape. And it was a pretty good anime. You should watch it. Um. The end is kind of eh, because it's like a mystery, but like, it was pretty enjoyable, you know? Anyway, B obtained protective room. I really hope I'm saying room right. I didn't actually look up how to say it. They're so rude. 
Ugh, I hate teenage girls. I've never met a teenage girl that wasn't mean and scary. That's a lie, I know like one teenage girl that doesn't scare me. This is the theater club's room. It's locked. I may be able to find some curtains in there. I wonder if any of the girls is a member of this club. Wee. She do be running though. Say, are any of you members of the theater club? Not really. Not really? Not me. Who wants to know? Well, there's a talent agent waiting outside. He's only interested in teenage girls with a passion for role-playing, though. What is it that you want? I just need to borrow something from your club room. You have the key, don't you? Hmm. Fine, you can have it. If you can do me a favor first. I'll do you a favor. I'll conveniently forget to tell the principal that you three broke into the school at night. Deal? Aren't you trespassing too? So, what's the favor you need? Get my notebook. It's in classroom 3C under my desk. Should I get the notebook for her? I mean, sure. If you do find it, please don't look through it. Sure, sure. We. Now to check under each and every desk for the notebook. ASMR keyboard clicking. Can I look in the notebook? This looks like that girl's private journal. Fuck it, I'm looking through it. Let's see. Ugh, it's just math problems and girly doodles all over. This isn't worth my time. I hope she never finds out that I looked through her private notebook, but honestly, like, if she's just ashamed of doing math, like, what are we doing as a society? Hey, queen. Shit. Here's your notebook. Yep, that's it. I hope you didn't look through it. Nope. Your math is safe. <laughs> of course you looked. <laughs> hope you at least solved some of the exercises. What, did you really think I'd leave my personal journal in your hands? Well, a promise is a promise anyways. Here's the key. Bring it back when you're done with it. Thanks. Wee. Wee. I love the running animation. It's so good. Once again... I keep forgetting to select the item. I'm just, like, so... Yay! Um... What was I in here for? Oh, yeah, a curtain. Yoink! Oh, I forgot you could turn the lights on. <laughs> Can I open the boxes? Yes! What's the letter say? Roses are red. Violets are probably violet. My love for you sparkles like the glow of a diamond. I... I watch you every day. I watch you every night. I watch you. 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 <laughs> Doesn't sound right. I'm sure it's fun. Anyway, you know. I'm sure everything is all hunky dory. Now I'm just gonna put the. <laughs> Aneurysm. Perfect. I need hair. Shoop. I 
never want to do that again. I cut my own hair all the time, but I'm also kind of crazy. Finger cracking ASMR. Okay, confession time. The first time I ran in the hallway. Just kidding, I don't want to spoil anything. <laughs> Anywho. <laughs> the first time I ran in the hallway that happened. And it absolutely scared the shit out of me. I was not expecting it. It just happened. And then I was like, oof, no thank you. And it gave me the biggest spook of all spooks. Everything's ready. All that's left is to wait five minutes and then burn the hair. This is going to be such a pain to clean up. And we're back. Oh, with a memory. Seriously, stop messing with these things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or the What if you end up summoning some ghost or the devil and condemning your soul to an eternity in the netherworld? What if your soul is already damned? Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat It was a joke. Me and my inner demons talking to each other. You're not gonna find him this way, you know. You'll just do whatever you want, no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. I prefer ambitious idiot. So, will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, cat, you know that. And yet here we are. Fine, you win. It's in the occult club. There's a golden envelope in one of the drawers, but they won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Hello? That's nice. I'ma talk to my girls Hello. I'ma talk to my girls one more time. Oh, they left. Well, you know what they say. I am sorry for my indigestion. Jesus Christmas. Well, you know what they say. Jesus Christmas. <laughs> That's exactly what they say. Let's do this. Alright, now I just have to blow out the can... The candles, did they just? I guess I should count to a hundred. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Why am I doing this? This game couldn't possibly work. 55, 56, 57, 58. I wonder if mom is worried about me. Huh? What was that? 79, 80, 81. Welcome back, bud. What's all that noise? Is anyone there? 97, 98, 99. 100. 
So I open my eyes. Donde estoy? It worked? It worked? It worked! I can't believe it! This is incredible! But where am I? It's a hallway? It definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable! How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting! I can't believe it worked! If I wake up from this and it turns out to be a dream, well, that would be disappointing to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. Objective updated. Explore the place. <laughs> a door with an odd pattern. A door with an odd pattern. It's very locked. Some yucky goo. Can I burn it? Ugh. Oh, that sucks. A small door with an odd pattern. It's locked. <laughs> Hold up to climb. Mm. A fairly normal looking door. It's locked. <laughs> door with a glossy finish. I bet it's locked. A door with a nod pattern. It's locked. Did I just see eyeballs? This stuff makes me uneasy. What if it comes alive or something? You know, that's chilling. A door with an odd pattern. A door with an odd pattern. A small door with an odd pattern. That's strange. Have I already passed through here? I have. Hmm. There must be something I missed. Let's traverse back. There's a gnat flying around me. He's quite annoying. Hmm. I feel like the door should have come past by now. But you know, I'm sure it's fine. I can- <laughs> I was gonna run. <laughs> uh, am I lost? I don't remember this hallway being so long before. <laughs> I almost walked past the key because I was trying to run in the hallway. There's a key hanging from a hook. Take key? Sure! Obtained fairly normal looking key. I, I, I'm, just, I'm guessing here. It probably goes in the fairly normal looking door. But I don't know that for sure. I'm just, I'm just talking out my ass here. But um, you know, high strange goop. Kinda looks like eyeballs. The key fits. Huh? What's this? Am I back at school already? Oh, I can run. A paper slip with some rules and regulations. No running in the hallways, no screaming during recess, no escaping ever. You can't stop me. Oh. This is just kind of fun. Classroom 4A. Classroom 56W. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while, and in return, you get... nothing. Oogie. Hello? Hello? Oogie. Do you even know where you are? You chose a one-way trip to hell, kid. Wee. Wee. You didn't think this far. 
Now that you can prove that these rituals work, you have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. That's not very cash money of you. Are you lost? Well, I didn't think I was lost, but like... I mean, I don't know where I am, but like... I know where I am, you know? Hello? Hello? You should give up. You will never leave this place. Well, I guess I'll just traverse back down. You know? You know, I'm sure it's chillin'. Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> How are you? How you doing? Your mother will be devastated to learn that she's now completely alone. No husband, no daughter. Everybody left her. How pitiful. Oh, you. Hey, Mom, I'm sorry I abandoned you for witchcraft. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then, and now you won't be able to tell your mother goodbye either. That's just rude to bring up my family issues. What if I told you someone you know is in here with you? Would that make you hopeful? Relieved? I know what you're thinking. Then I can escape with them. But these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. The carpet freaks me out. After all, why would you give your prey an escape? Oh hey, fam, y'all are back. How's it how's it hanging? How y'all doing tonight? Good, good to see ya. And you hear a poor little lap mouth. And here you are, a poor little lap mouth stuck in a maze. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you. And then, snap. Snap. Makes weird sound with mouth. Hello. <laughs> I don't like you. I mean, maybe we can be friends, you know? I'm not opposed to being your friend, it's just... You kinda snuck up on me and I, that's not how friends do, you know? You know, we, we surprise friends, but we don't, we don't terrorize friends. Sometimes we terrorize friends, but you know, it's, it's funny. Not when you do it though, bud. I seriously get like... You know like the scary maze game? Where like if you hit the side it like gives you a jump scare but then it always gives you a jump scare? How would you like to stay trapped here until you die? That's not very cash money of you. Do you like it? I think it's just what you need. She's so rude. Like, we could just talk. Maybe now you will reflect on the stupidity of your actions. Or I can just vibe in here. I mean, it is kinda tiny, but... In the meantime, I'll just watch you rot away. Shut up, that's enough. <laughs> Whoever you are, get out of my head. My life is my business. My decisions are mine alone. Let me out of this place. I know there's a way out. There has to be. Please. There must be a way. I want to go home. Yikes. still in this hallway. I don't like this. I need to get out of here. <laughs> I like how straightforward the objectives are. 
this door is open. Wasn't it boarded up? Everything else is locked. I have no other choice but to go in. I really need to not eat before I record. Blood. I mean, it could be this, not tomato sauce. A beheaded corpse. That can't be. How is this possible? I just saw her a while ago. I don't understand. No. <laughs> oh my god. This can't be real. It's it's not real. Right? A bloody corpse. The lower half is missing. I. This is my fault. A welcoming door. It's locked. I have to get out. The door. I can leave. I can go home? Seriously, the art. God bless the artist, like, I love it. I don't want to die. Hello? God, it's so good. It's just, it's so good. It's so cute. The art, the story. Just, just mwah. Note from the devs. We really appreciate you taking your time to play our little game. It means the world to us. What you've played is the prologue of a larger project we are currently working on. We would love to be able to bring it to life as well. But this highly depends on the feedback we get for Project Cat. I know it's annoying to ask, but it would help us a lot if you could leave a comment or rate our game on itch.io. Thank you so much. Once again, I love this game. I feel like it has so much potential. Like, it's an indie game, but the art, the story is, like, so pretty. And I know that, like, RPG horror is, like, kind of a very specific niche subgenre, but if you like this game, like, I'll leave the link to the game in the description. Like, feel free to play it for yourself or comment. There's, like, all sorts of different things you can do that I didn't do this time that I did the last time I played it, which is kind of fun to mess around with. There's, like so many random things you can do by interacting with other objects and yeah i just i love that style of game where you can do whatever you want pretty much so if you enjoyed this game if you enjoyed this game play consider liking commenting subscribing hitting the notification bell because that totally does so many things for everyone <laughs> and i'll see you in the next one bye